Concerned about rampant wildlife trafficking? Then let's find out in 60 seconds what Europe does for you. Illegal wildlife trade is a low-risk business with high returns. We're talking between 8 and 20 billion euros per year globally. And although it's not a new phenomenon, it has reached unprecedented levels driven by demand for medicines, fashion, pets and food. This trafficking not only threatens the survival of many species, such as elephants and rhinos, but also the livelihoods of local communities and fuels corruption and violence. So what is the EU doing about it? The EU has been engaged in the fight against wildlife trafficking for decades. It supports protected areas and funds biodiversity protection in Africa. It performs strict checks to ensure that only legal wildlife products enter the EU and it fights wildlife crime at international level. Through development aid, the EU also helps to reduce poverty and inequality in countries of origin, two of the root causes of wildlife crime. And in 2016, the EU introduced new measures to prevent trafficking, stepping up the fight against organised crime and strengthening cooperation between source, destination and transit countries. This was 60 Seconds, brought to you by the European Parliamentary Research Service. Thanks for listening.